After that, I flew straight back here. So the Order of St. Michael funded the whole Phoenix operation? And Anna Maria ran it. What happened to the gold? Maynard didn't know. You think Anna Maria does? Did. Remember, she wanted you to help her find a missing treasure. Treasure? Exactly. But what kind? What, the elixir of life? Some kind of wonder cure for every illness? Or a weapon. No. No, Maynard was crazy. You can't believe him. Why should he lie? Anna Maria wouldn't have got mixed up in... Maynard was vaporized. That powder, the gold, it's a fuel, Georges. Fuel for a weapon. Believe me. Well, now, I've made a lovely pot of tea. We need to go back and check out the monastery. Oh? Oh, what's happened? Let me come with you. Sorry, Mark. You better leave this to us. I can handle myself. It could be dangerous. We need you here, in case something goes wrong. I always miss the fun. We're not in this for the fun, Mark. Come on, Nico. Let's go. The square is lifeless. Perfect conditions for sneaking in. Next to Archie is a near-empty bottle of maths. Can he really be drinking that stuff? Or yeah, maybe he's working part-time as a painter. Hello, Archie. How you doing? Who's that, then? Well, it's me, George Stobart, from the apartment block. My dear boy, what a pleasure to see you again. Giles, isn't it? I never forget a face. Just names, huh? So, what brings you down this way? Well, in my line of work, you've got to keep moving. Work? I'm writing a book, you see. Oh, what's it called? Tipples Round the Globe. Kid's story, huh? Little cat, maybe, on a boat with some animal chums. Dear me, no. Encyclopedia of booze, country by country. You haven't got very far, then. Can't see straight enough to write. Hmm, wonder why that is. Damned if I know. So how did Brother Mark deal with the bird droppings? Ha! <laughs> that was damn funny, Godfrey. Haven't laughed so much in years. So was he angry? Not until you left. Then he went into a right old paddy, attacked me with his broom. Really? I spent the whole day picking the bristles out of my... Ah, well, all in good cause. You sure do have a thing for my friend there. She's a fine woman. Curvy. Voluptuous. Lovely soft edges. Huh? What's with the maths? What comes after Macon? It does. The alphabet of booze. Macon, maths, bouton. Oh, I see. You're not drinking it. You're just tasting. Somebody's got it. But how come you're still alive? That's a moot point, Jeffrey, old fella. How would you like to do a trade for your maths? Well, it depends on what you've got to trade. Can I interest you in this one-of-a-kind telescopic golf club? Do I look like a man who has the time to play golf? Time, yes. Inclination, no. Bang on, Garfield! Take a look at this. Isn't it beautiful? It looks like cheap tourist tat to me, old boy. It's an original rosary from the 16th century. Hmm. You think it'd keep my trousers up? I doubt it, Archie. What would you say to this vintage salami, Archie? I'd say, beggar off. Damn stuff gives me wind. I know the feeling. Chap who moves in my kind of circles can't afford to have glitches in the old body odor department. Of course. Have you seen this? It's a vintage red from inside the Vatican. You call out a bottle. It's travel size. I wouldn't travel across the road for that. You like wine, don't you? I've been known to have the odd drop. What do you make of this? It's a vintage red from inside the Vatican. What kind of 
bottle do you call that? It's travel size. Well, it wasn't worth the trip, if you ask me. Cheers, Archie. What do you think you're doing? Oh, just admiring your bottle of meths? That, that's got to last bit till sunrise, you know. You sure live the high life, Archie. Hey, a half-full bottle of Krug Champagne. Vatican. Party City. The trash can's full of paper. On top of the paper is a half-empty bottle of champagne. Hey, Archie, can you spare a minute? That's all I can spare, old boy. Look what I just found. A legit bottle of Krug. The best champagne in the world. I'd give my right arm for that. Ah, it reminds me of the old days. Christmas tree lights, foul Thames, twinkling, plateful of shepherd's pie, the great and the good. Where are they now, eh? Where are they now? How would you like to do a trade for your mess? Well, it depends on what you've got to trade. How about the bottle of Krug for your mess? You've got yourself a deal, Mr. Stubbles. Hand it over and let the good times roll. <laughs> Enjoy the mess. Rather on the sweet side for my taste, as it happened. Cheers, Archie. The meths are mine. I can feel the arsonist in me coming back to the surface. Oh, the smell of the meths makes my eyes sting. Well, here goes. The guards will be coming any moment. Time to hide. Emergency. 
Emergency, the bin is burning. The bin is burning. Now that the guards have their hands full, I can get inside unnoticed. So, a secret room containing a secret machine. What are you talking about? This is our backup machine for special orders. Now, how did you get in here? And do I have to call the Swiss guard before you leave? I think the sister and I need to have ourselves a little chat. What are you planning to do? Let's just say we need to get sisterly. You check around in here. It won't take long. Good luck. Oh, uh, you too, sister. You're gonna need it. A batch of wafers cooling down on the conveyor. Hmm, they smell good. Well, no one's watching. I'll have one. Hmm, pretty good. I'm sure another wouldn't do any harm. The wafer machine is newer than the one in the main factory. I can't make head nor tail of the machine settings, though. Now, what do these buttons do? This wafer-making business is trickier than it looks. Something in the darkness. No, it can't be. At the base of the mixing vats, traces of gold dust. It's monatomic gold. But what's this stuff doing near a wafer-making machine? Monatomic gold, but why near a wafer maker? Huh? I can hear Nico returning with Sister Angelica. I think she'll cooperate now. Won't you, Sister? So, this wafer machine, what's it for? Special orders. I think for Il Papa himself. And what makes them special? The holy powder, of course. As a matter of fact, we've just finished a run tonight. Why is this machine used only for special orders? Why doesn't every wafer have the holy powder? If every wafer had it, it wouldn't be special, would it? Careful, sister. Don't you think it's a bit strange having a special powder to make a special batch of wafers? I just do what I'm told. What's happened, George? I found traces of monatomic gold in this machine. But why would the church be putting gold into communion wafers? One thing's for sure. It's not to protect their teeth. Where's the rest of this holy powder? I have no idea. A batch came in and left almost immediately. It's being used for something else, I suppose. Someone's coming. But no one uses the factory at night. Quickly, shut the doors. It's Cardinal Gianelli. 
don't think he's catching up on his paperwork. That's very odd. He never uses the factory entrance. I think we need to follow him. Um, what should I do? Stay here and pray for forgiveness. <laughs>